Okay, if you were just on Facebook like five minutes ago, you saw my kids make a knockoff Starbucks drink. And now I'm gonna try and make one. So, um, I the strawberry refreshers, they're good. Not really my jam, I'm more of a coffee girl. So let me show you what I've got going on here. All right, so we have a new, um, um, oh my gosh, frother. I can't even talk today. It's a milk frother, but this does cold foam as well. So this is fantastic. If you're in one of my parties, oh, hang on. Kiki really wanted to see this. Let's see. Let me grab her party quick. My kids are outside drinking their refreshers and watching the neighborhood go by. <laughs> and I will be out there shortly because it is a beautiful day in Minnesota today. It's finally not raining. It has rained the entire last week. It's been a little bit miserable. Okay. So I'm going to use my new milk frother. Okay. So it has settings on here. The snowflake is the setting we're going to use. That's the cold. Okay. So I found this recipe online. I have never made this. So first time, um, but it calls for heavy whipping cream. So a quarter cup of that. So I'm going to use my little quarter cup, easy read measuring cup. So I can fill that up there. A quarter cup is four tablespoons. If you didn't know, and uh, one tablespoon of heavy whipping cream is 50 calories and um, five grams of fat. So I guess if you're looking keto, here we go, right? But you just have to leave out the caramel. Okay, so four tablespoons or a quarter cup of heavy whipping cream, then two tablespoons or a, an eighth of a cup, right? Of 2% milk, Henry Bark. All right, so two tablespoons of 2% milk and then one tablespoon of salted caramel syrup, which I picked this up at Target yesterday. This was, I think, $6. Um, hang on where my tablespoons go. Oh, there they are. Um, which is a little spendy. But on the other hand, if I buy one of these at Starbucks, it's like $7 for a, a grande, which is a medium if you're not a Starbucks seeker. Okay, so this smells delicious. All right, so we did, so a quarter cup, fill this up, heavy cream, half of this, so two tablespoons of 2% milk, and then one tablespoon of the salted caramel syrup. All right, so we're gonna put the lid on. I've got her plugged in. So let's see, I've not done this upside down here. So let me turn it on. Okay, there we go. Okay, so there's a power button on the bottom and then the top half is an arrow. And it's now pointing at the um, cold. So this is going right now. You can't even hear it. So while that's uh, frothing and making our cold foam, I've got my cup of ice. I picked up this cold brew at Target. It was on sale. Um, I've never had this kind, but I thought, you know, it's all right. I like coffee. So we're gonna fill that. We'll leave room for our cold foam. There we go. Pamper Chef is coming out with cold brew coffee this summer. So if you're watching this video, you're the only one who's, who know about it. So if you haven't hosted in a while, you should host in May because the cold brew coffee will be out in June. And I'm hoping that our coffee maker will also be out in June. So this is a frother, it's still going. This is a frother and then the coffee maker machine is not available yet. Um, Pamper Chef, when they release something new, they wanna make sure it works fantastic for the public. And so they send it out to a bunch of us directors and things and if we find anything that we're like, hey, this is an issue, they will hold the release so they can fix that issue. So they had a little bit of an issue with some of the K-Cup um, um, adapters, but only with some of the consultants, but it was enough for them to say, you know what, let's not hassle the public with this, let's fix it, right? So we fix it and then we release the product. So fingers crossed, June. And uh, June is double free products. So if you are like, I haven't hosted, I don't really know what that means. 
Um, it just means that I set up a link for you to share. It's a shopping link. And then we can do alongside that link, we can do a party here on Facebook where I do live videos like this. We play games, we talk recipes, we have fun. Or I can just send you your shopping link and you're like, hey, I send it out to all my friends and everybody orders and that's it. Okay. Do you believe we're done? Yep. Okay. I'm excited. I have not ever made this before. Ooh, this looks really good. Okay. So look inside. Cold foam. We just made our own. All right. La 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 la. Look at that. I'm excited. Oh my gosh, I think I have too much. Oh, maybe I'm good. Maybe I'm good. Hey. Okay, I'm super excited. Oh my gosh. Okay, this tastes just like it. Just like it. I just made it myself. Oh my gosh. Okay. So here's how much is left. Not that much. Hi, Linda. Linda, I just made my own salted caramel cold foam cold brew with my new Pampered Chef milk frother. Oh my gosh, I keep bending over. There we go. All right, so the recipe, quarter cup of heavy cream, two tablespoons of 2% milk, one tablespoon of salted caramel syrup. So this is a kind of a caloric drink. Um, this is not something I would drink every day, but I'm definitely drinking this today. Just look at that. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just made my own. Okay, so this would have been what? Six something at Starbucks, seven something. Ooh, and that iced coffee, oh, that's got a kick to it, damn, holy cow. Okay, so I found this iced coffee at Target on sale. It's unsweetened, because I prefer unsweetened coffee. Coffee. I'll add my sweetener to it myself. Um, this is delicious. And then I do have this caramel that I could drizzle on top. Should I do that? Probably. Why not? Why not? Calories don't count on Sunday. Did you know that? There we go. Awesome, awesome. I'm super excited. I'm super excited because I have been holding off with getting this out and playing with it. I don't know why. I love salted caramel and I love the cold foam cold brews at Starbucks, but they're so expensive. And they're more calories than I usually like to give to my drinks. Um, but I like to save money. So I will drink this at home and I'll tweak it. Maybe we'll see if we can try and do a cold foam with just milk and not the heavy cream or maybe a different ratio. But anyway, isn't this the bomb? Okay, so if you're hosting with me right now, you can get this product for 60% off with your host rewards and all you need is $200 in sales at your party. So if you're hosting with me right now and you haven't hit that $200 in sales, make sure you remind your friends that you have a link open because we're all busy. We all forget these things, right? Um, especially if it's not our own party, but you can get this for 60% off or you can get something else for 60% off and get this for half off when you host. If you're a past host, you can get this for 10% off with your past host discount as long as you've hosted with Pamper Chef in the last 12 months. Um, so anyway, and then host this month, it's May now, get an additional $100 in free products so you could get this for free. So, I mean, there's lots of options. And then if you're like, forget that, I wanna buy it, I just wanna get it. Um, when you sign up this month, you get, or you can earn this, along with the new coffee maker for free when you sign up this month. So it's a really good deal. And it's a really good month to sign up with summer coming up and things like that. People are looking to grill and they change their cooking style for the summer, right? If you have weather that changes. Um, so like I've grilled the last two days, I've used entirely different products than what I use in my kitchen. And so I have a lot of camping people in my life and they have Pamper Chef in their camper because they know it lasts and it's good quality, and they're like, I cook differently in my camper than in my kitchen. So anyway, I am excited about this. I'm gonna go sit out on my deck and get some work done. Um, but yeah, oh my gosh, this is fantastic. And this tastes legit. This tastes just like the Starbucks cold foam. So, and it's salt caramel. Oh my gosh, so good. All right, I will see you guys later, bye.